Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today we have this braided beanie hat and for this hat you will need a weight 4 yarn, a 5.5mm crochet hook and a 6mm crochet hook. Don't forget the free written pattern will be on my blog crochetwithcarry.com. So to begin, chain 9. Then single crochet into the second chain from the hook and then single crochet into every chain to the end. For the next row, chain one and then turn your work. So now we're going to be working into the back loop of every stitch. So into the back loop of every stitch, make one single crochet. And then repeat this row for a total of 55 rows. So once you have your 55 rows completed, it should look like this. So now we're just going to join our two ends together by slip stitching. So once you've slip stitched your two ends together, we're going to turn it the right side out. So now we're going to switch hooks. We're going to take out our 5.5 millimeter hook and replace it with our six millimeter hook. Next, we're going to chain one and then make 55 single crochet all the way around the top edge of our brim. Thank you. 
once you have your 55 single crochet we're going to slip stitch into that very first single crochet just to close the round For the next round, chain 3, this counts as our first double crochet, and then make 4 more double crochet. So all together you have five double crochet. So on top of this fifth double crochet, we're going to chain 10. Now we're going to slip stitch into the front loop of the last worked double crochet and into that loop that's in the center of that double crochet post. So make your slip stitch. Now work five more double crochet. On top of the fifth double crochet, chain 10. Then slip stitch on top of the front loop of the last worked double crochet and then into that center post of that last worked double crochet. So you're going to repeat that all the way around. You're going to make five double crochet, chain 10, and then slip stitch into the last worked double crochet. So repeat that all the way around. So here we are at the end of the round. So make five double crochet. Then 
then chain 10 then slip stitch into that last worked double crochet and then slip stitch on top of this chain 3 just to close your round For the next round, chain 1, single crochet into that same space and then single crochet into every stitch all the way around. When you reach your chain 10 loop, just push that forward and then work a single crochet into the next stitch. So repeat that all the way around. At the end of this round, you should have 55 single crochet. Here we are at the end of the round. Make sure you have 55 single crochet. Once you have your 55 single crochet completed, we're going to slip stitch into the first single crochet to close the round. So those two last rows set the pattern for this beanie. So repeat those two rows over and over again. Your next row will be chain three. This counts as your first double crochet. Then make four more double crochet. Then chain 10 then slip stitch into the last worked double crochet so you're going to repeat that you're going to make five double crochet 
chain 10 and then slip stitch into the last work the double crochet and repeat that all the way around Here we are again at the end of the round, so make 5 double crochet Then chain 10 and then slip stitch on top of the last worked double crochet. And then slip stitch on top of this chain three just to close your round. For the next round, chain one, single crochet into that same stitch, and then single crochet into every stitch all the way around making sure you have 55 single crochet at the end of this round. Here we are at the end of the round, just single crocheting, make sure you have 55 single crochet and then when you reach the end we're going to slip stitch into the very first single crochet. So go ahead and repeat those last two rows over and over again until your entire beanie measures about 9 inches long. If you want a more slouchier hat, add more rows. So once you have your 9 inches, your next round is going to be chain 3. This counts as your first double crochet. And then you're going to place one double crochet into every stitch all the way around. At the end of this round you should have 55 double crochet. At 
the end of the round, slip stitch on top of that chain 3 to close the round. So now we're going to start weaving these loops together to create a braid. So on the bottom, just grab one loop, feed the loop on top of that through that bottom loop and repeat all the way up. And then repeat that all the way around your beanie hat. So now we need to start securing these braids together. So for the next round, chain one, and then we're going to be working in sets of five single crochet. So into that same space as our chain one, make your first single crochet, and then make three more. Into our fifth single crochet, insert your hook through the loop and then work your single crochet into the next stitch. For the next set of five single crochet, your first single crochet will be through that same braided loop and your next single crochet. So that's your first single crochet of your set. So now you need to make four more single crochet. Into the fourth single crochet, insert your hook into that first loop and then single crochet into the next stitch. So you're going to repeat that all the way around. So here we are at the end of the row. We make our five single crochet. The first single crochet is worked through that loop. So one, two, three, four, and then on the fifth, insert your hook into this loop and then into the next stitch and make your single crochet and then you're going to slip stitch so insert your hook through that loop and then into the first single crochet and slip stitch complete it so now we're going to do some decreasing 
So chain one into that same space, make one single crochet. Then we're going to single crochet two together, insert your hook into the next stitch, pull your yarn through, insert your hook into the next stitch, pull your yarn through, yarn over and pull through all three. So you're going to repeat that all the way around. You're going to single crochet into the next stitch, then single crochet two together into the following two stitches. You should end the round with one single crochet and then you're going to slip stitch into that first single crochet to close the round and then you're going to repeat this row one more time so chain one single crochet into that first space then single crochet two together so repeat that all the way around single crochet then single crochet two together all the way around. At the end of the round, slip stitch into that first single crochet. Then chain one and then leaving a long tail, cut your yarn. Now is a good time to weave in all your ends. Now we need to close up this top. So grab your yarn needle and thread that through your long tail. And then you're simply going to weave your yarn through every stitch in and out all the way around. When you have your yarn weaved all the way around the top of your hat, simply pull your tail tight. And then secure with a few stitches. And that's your beanie completed. All you have to do now is just add your preferred pom-pom, whether that be a yarn pom-pom or just a faux fur pom-pom. It's completely up to you. So don't forget the free written pattern is on my blog crochetwithcarry.com. Until next time, take care.